early midterm voting in Florida is underway, so we at the firearm firm want to make sure you exercise your right to vote and stay on the right side of the law when it comes to your Second Amendment rights. Therefore, we want to make sure all of you who have a Florida concealed weapon or firearm license, commonly referred to as a CWFL, know the law regarding carrying a concealed firearm while you are casting your ballot. Florida Statute 790.06 subsection 12a lists all the prohibited areas that your CWFL does not authorize you to carry, which includes polling places. Anyone with the CWFL who carries a concealed firearm into a polling place commits a second degree misdemeanor, which is punishable up to 60 days in the county jail and or a $500 fine. It is important to be aware that some of the places where you may normally carry a concealed firearm will be off limits if they are being used as a polling place. However, there is no prohibition on having a firearm in your vehicle in the parking lot of a polling place, so be sure to either leave your firearm at home or secure it in your vehicle before you go inside to vote. With anti-gunners trying to pass federal gun control bills in Congress and a president who says he will sign anything that comes to his desk, it is extremely important that we vote for people who understand the phrase shall not be infringed. Locally, we have a governor who promises to sign constitutional carry if it makes it to his desk, but have not had a state legislature willing to send him a bill. Be sure to do your research on all the candidates and vote. Your vote counts, but only if you use it. Be sure to show your support for the Second Amendment and help fight the anti-gun algorithm by clicking the like button below. Also, don't forget to click the subscribe icon in the lower right hand corner of your screen if you are new to our channel. Until next time, stay armed and educated.